Today we demonstrate you the latest Russian design wheeled for support vehicle K4386 Typhoon VDV with a remotely operated weapon station, incorporating an automatic cannon and an anti-tank guided missile system. The K4386 Typhoon VDV is the newest Russian-made a droppable wheeled vehicle designed to provide support to airborne and air assault units in any operational environment. Having a gross vehicle weight of some 15 tons, the land platform has a payload capacity of about 2.3 tons and transports up to seven servicemen, including the crew. Owing to the integration of an effective engine with a maximum power output of 350 horsepower, the K4386 produces a maximum speed of no less than 100 km per hour. The Typhoon VDV is an ideal companion for an air assault team. It transports servicemen, provides fire support and protection, and evacuates the troops once their task has been completed. Moreover, the land platform features a sufficient protection against the most popular threats, including both ballistic and explosively formed ones. Heavy fire support is a key to success on the modern battlefield. In order to give dismounted troops more effective assault capabilities, the K4386 vehicle has been equipped with a remotely operated weapon station carrying a 30mm automatic cannon and a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun. This combination of weapons has proven itself as a rather effective solution. However, any success in modern warfare could hardly be achieved without guided weapons. Tactical and cost-effective guided weapon systems lay ground for victory, as they allow engaging both soft skin and hard skin critically important targets rapidly and at dramatically less ammunition consumption rate. To this end, the K4386 Typhoon VDV with a remotely operated weapon station, a rather compact vehicle that has a firepower of much bigger infantry fighting vehicles, has been equipped with an anti-tank guided missile system. This modification of the unmanned turret has been fitted with a war-guided anti-tank guided missile system. This type of guidance ensures both cost-effectiveness and high jamming resistance. The missile's warhead is capable of engaging almost any well-protected target on the battlefield, including modern main battle tanks with explosive reactive armor and hardened engineering installations. The ATGM launcher with two slots for guided missiles is mounted on the right side of the unmanned turret. Therefore, the vehicle's full armament suit incorporates a 30mm automatic cannon a coaxial general-purpose machine gun, and two ready-use guided missiles. The gunner fires the guided weapons using the main control board of the remotely operated weapon station. This footage demonstrates you the engagement of a simulated target by the ATGM system armed variant of the Typhoon VDV combat vehicle. You see, the vehicle is being prepared to launch a guided missile. The gunner searches for a target. The target has been found. The gunner launches a missile and tracks it via the system's sighting unit. Then the missile flies to a target. The tank type stationary target has been successfully hit. The operations required to engage the target with a guided missile are easy and don't require long-winded preparations. Just determine a target, find it, and then engage. The K4386 4x4 armored combat vehicle is a cost-effective and power solution to the transportation and fire support of dismounted troops on the battlefield. The land platform is actually a two-axle wheeled armored fighting vehicle that transports a team. The specialization of troops doesn't matter, be it special forces or linear infantrymen, provides fire support against almost any land target even against main battle tanks and tank-based vehicles, and brings the servicemen back. So, the missile-armed Typhoon VDV really packs a punch. Dear visitors, stay tuned 
and we will demonstrate you cutting-edge Russian-designed machinery. Thank you for your attention.